What's up guys, it is Fatty Mancy here from Real Results Fitness and in this video what I want to discuss is fat loss and how a lot of us need to lose a lot more weight than we think we do. You'll see that the training footage I have in the background is a little bit different than what you might be used to. I'm currently on a uh, two day upper and lower, sorry, four day uh, upper and lower split. So I go upper, lower, break, upper, lower, break, break, and then repeat. Um, well, we could talk about my training split in another video. Uh, what I really want to discuss in this video is um, how much weight people actually need to lose and how people are kind of fooling themselves when they think that they don't have a lot of weight to lose. Now, I say this because it comes up a lot when people are looking you know, for advice or looking for some kind of guidance on what they should do or how they should do. and you hear from guys and girls alike and that is you know, I just I, I like I want to maintain my weight I don't want to lose too much weight because you know I don't I don't want to get really skinny and uh, as if as if building muscle is very easy but uh, <laughs> I don't want to get I don't want to get really skinny I kind of want to maintain my weight and I want to tone so that is kind of the gist of, of what I hear almost on a, on a daily basis. Kind of frustrating to tell people this and them not wanting to listen. You know, when they are looking for you for advice, you're basically telling them something they don't want to hear. And unless you have been on a big, successful body transformation, it is kind of hard to understand. I think the most weight I've lost at one time was like a three and a half or four. Yeah, I think like a three and a half month uh, time. It was about 35 pounds. And I remember thinking, you know, if you would have told me in the beginning of that transformation that I needed to lose 35 pounds to look the way I did, there's no way in hell I would have believed you. And I, I would have gone with the same exact notion of... You know, I have way more muscle than that. I don't need to lose that much weight. Um, but in actuality, <laughs> I did need to lose that much weight. And that was my first really big successful transformation. And even then, uh, I, I looked really good. I'll see if I could uh, flip a, uh, I look really good, I should say, compared to what I thought. But... Uh, it's not where I want it to be. Let's just say that. Um, had you told me I would have lost 35 pounds and still not been exactly where I wanted to be, I would have told you you're crazy. So that's kind of where the notion that uh, this happens. And a lot of people, uh, like I said, men and women alike have the same exact thing. Like guys say like, you know, I just, I just need to lose 10 pounds and, and cut up and get lean. Like it's really not that easy if uh, you know if you're above and, and this is gonna be dependent on multiple different calculators that you could find along the way but if you're above I would say you know 15 to 16 percent body fat you have a decent amount of weight to lose I would say uh, to get that uh, lean beach body physique that you're looking for yeah we're aiming and uh, everyone's opinion is different, but we're aiming in the, you know, 20 pound ish range range. I actually was speaking with somebody the other day and had this exact same conversation, which gave me the idea for this video. And that was um, she it was a female and she was around five one. She wanted to, you know, tone or or just tighten up her core or stomach area. And I think this is the probably the most awkward part as a trainer and 
This is where you just got to hit them with that harsh reality. And men and women alike, like I've said, that you have a lot more fat to lose than you think you do. And if you think for whatever reason that all you need to lose is five pounds and all of a sudden you're going to see your abs, but you have, but you currently have no, uh, <laughs> nowhere near uh, visible abs at the moment and you think you only need to lose like a few pounds, five pounds, even like 10 pounds, then you are doing yourself a disservice by absolutely fooling yourself. Uh, guys, don't be afraid to lose the weight. Again, at a healthy rate, don't, you know, I'm not a proponent of crash dieting or whatnot. 1% um, of your body weight is a nice, uh, healthy range. Uh, if you're heavier, maybe a little bit more in the beginning stages, but about 1%, which for most people breaks down to one to two pounds a week. And that will help you to maintain your muscle, men and women alike. It's good to have muscle because the more muscle we have, the more fat we burn, and you will not look uh, lean and, or sorry, you will not look huge and bulky like you think you might, uh, which we can go on another topic. Uh, but everybody just thinks that gaining muscle is really easy. You know, I'll hear uh, kids in high school talk to me saying, you know, they're about 130 pounds, 140 pounds. You know, I just I just want to get lean. I, I don't want to get too big. All right. Well, if you can do that without drugs, let me know the secret. Because these guys are making it sound like they can gain muscle extremely quick. And in actuality, it's a very, very, very slow process. But anyways, guys, that's gonna wrap up this video. Um, I do have a nutrition book uh, that has all of this, a nutrition ebook that has all of this outlined, uh, which I'll link down below. Uh, if you do wanna check it out, feel free. It's uh, fairly inexpensive and it does come with a, a meal plan, but more importantly, it talks about how uh, you should be training, or excuse me, how you should be eating according to your goals. Anyways, guys, that's the video. If you like the video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, and I will talk to you on the next video.